Hey guys, it's Chris with another Tech Tips video. Today, we're gonna to go over six cool Google services you didn't know existed that will make your life easier. Let's jump right in. Starting with one of my favorites. You can get a personal phone number through Google Voice and then make and receive calls using that number. I primarily use my Google Voice number for when I sign up for an online service and they ask for a number or for making Craigslist purchases and I don't want to use my personal cell. What's great about voice is that when you get a call, it's really easy to tell that it's coming from your Google Voice number because this voiceover will play. You can also download the Google Voice app, making it even easier to separate your personal number from your Google Voice number. This is great if you have a side business or side hustle because then you can have two separate numbers. Next up is Google Photo Scan, and currently it has five stars in the App Store. Basically, you can scan and save your printed photos using your phone's camera. What makes it great though, is that it takes multiple pictures of the same photo, removes the glare, and then stitches them together for high quality rendering. It also automatically crops the photo using edge detection. Let me show you. I'm gonna take this card that I have here take a picture. Photoscan will then use these four circles and ask me to line up the image. After you do that, you're basically done. Here's what it looks like. All right, moving on, we have Google Fonts. It's basically a library of free fonts for you to use. It's also incredibly easy for you to install. For example, let's say you like this one called Lado. You download the zip, extract the files, and then hit install. Now, when you use something like Word or PowerPoint, you'll be able to see those fonts. They also have an extensive list of icons, which are great for you consultants out there making presentations. Okay, we have Google Trends next. I like using this for my keyword research when I'm trying to come up with YouTube content or just to see what the world is looking up right now. Seems like it's soccer. Let's do a quick example like COVID. If you type that into the search bar, it will show you some interesting data on the coronavirus. Let's go back five years. You'll see that around February 2020 is when it started getting a lot of interest. Scrolling down, you can also see interest by subregion, related topics, and related queries. Overall, just a great resource for research. Next up, Google Domains. The reason I like this is because I can store all my domains under one login and I can seamlessly sign up for a Google Workspace email. Google also integrates with a wide range of site builders and hosts, making it super easy to build a site with your custom domain name. I use Gmail all the time, so having everything under one service is just super convenient. All right, for our last Google service, it's basically embedded into YouTube. It's called the YouTube Audio Library and it lets you download and use free music and sound effects in your videos. You won't get flagged for copyright, so it gives you that peace of mind and you can easily sample songs by pressing on the play button. Let's try this one. And that's about it. I hope you found these useful. Let me know if there are any that you use that I can add to this list or a future video. I wanna thank you all for watching, follow for more tech tips, and I'll catch you guys for the next video.